Hello, God's children. Jesus loves you. Christians should be Christ-like. Um, here's some Bible verses from the King James versions that talk about being Christ-like. John 14, 15. If you love me, keep my commandments. Galatians 3, 27. For as many of you have been baptized into Christ, have been put on Christ. 1 Peter 2:21. For even hereunto were you a called, because Christ has also suffered for us, leaving us an example that you should follow his steps. Philippians 2, 5. Let this mind be in you, which is also in Jesus Christ. Um, people might claim they're Christians. A lot of them go to church. On Sundays because you know it's a one-time event you know they praise God for one hour and you know get with Christians and different people at this church but then when they go home their life is normal the rest of the week you know is that a true Christian shouldn't a true Christian be Christ like shouldn't we be trying to live like Christ every day every minute every hour of the day you know, it's just not a one-hour event or let's go to the church event on a Tuesday night, Wednesday night, you know, which is a social gathering with a get-together. To be like Christ, you pretty much have to let everything go. You must show, you know, that you are of God. You must show example. You must, you know, you know wear a cross. You know, if you're not into crosses, wear a WWJD bracelet, you know. Don't, don't be ashamed of God, because if we're ashamed of God, when it comes time for judgment, and he'll know that we were ashamed of him, he'll be ashamed of us. So we got to start living like Christ. We got to talk to people, you know, talk about God. You know, if you're not comfortable talking about God and you're a Christian, you know, are you really a Christian? I mean, a Christian should stand out. We stick out if we're Christians. We are not part of this world. We don't belong here. We belong in God's world. We should stick out like sore thumbs. We should show people what Christ is. We should lead example what Christ is. And, and you know, if you're a true Christian, you know what home is. You want to go home. You know. You don't want to live this world and then be able to say, oh, I'm blessed in this world. This world is great and everything. This world is kind of evil, what we're living in right now. And home is heaven, which is going to be paradise. We should be living for that. That's what home is. That's where the greatness is. You know, we have to feel that. We got we to gotta know that we want to go home. You know, God's going to look at us and want to see... He wants to see our excitement that Jesus is coming back and we want to go home. It's not just getting in a social group, let's get together, let's do this. Let's, we want to go home. We want to be with Christ. We want to, we need to act like Christ. But um, we just got to get together, understand that we are living in the last days and the ends of times right now. And like I said, I, we don't know the day or hour. Could be any second, could be years. We don't know. But are you ready for Jesus when he comes? Are you going to say you were a real Christian? Um, you can do all the, read the certain Bibles. You could do the water baptism. You could do all that stuff. But then if you are not living like a Christian every day, were you a real Christian? Were you really saved? You know, that's where you got to analyze yourself and say, am I ready when he comes? You know, we just have to get our act together. Because to be Christ-like, we should be wearing WWJDs. Like I'm wearing right here, a WWJD. You can read it here. Let's wear it. Let's let's show about God. Let's, let's you know, put a bumper sticker on your car. Just show that we have the love for God. We should not be ashamed of God. Because, you know, he'll be ashamed of us if we don't. We want him to know us. We want to build a relationship with him. That's what will 
God will look into us is our hearts. Do we have a relationship with him? Do we show each day that we were a disciple and that we loved him and we showed other people that we love God and we want to spread the gospel? Jesus loves you guys. And he's coming very coming back very, very soon. God bless you.